I promise to ask for help. To lean on you when I need you. To give you time to sort out your feelings. To say what's on my mind. To take a break from reality and let in a little romance. To surprise you with flowers and hold your hands. To save my girly TV shows for when you're not in. <laughs> to stop spoiling all the plots. Ten minutes in. <laughs> to support you in whatever you choose to do. To support you in whatever you choose to do. I promise to pay attention to details. To try to see the bigger picture. To respect your mind and encourage you to take risks with my support. To support you in your passion for helping others. To remind you of your talents and cheer for your successes. To keep teaching you how to load the dishwasher so you don't get the spinner stuck. <laughs> to pay a little attention so you keep loading the dishwasher. <laughs> to put you first. To put you first. I promise to tell you I love you and need you. To show you that I care and that you matter. To seek your opinions and trust your judgments. To ask your advice and consider your suggestions. To honour you, cherish you and hold you in my heart. To hug you, kiss you and keep you in my thoughts. I, I promise to, to love you. you. Today is a day you will always remember, the greatest in anyone's life. You'll start off the day just two people in love and end it as husband and wife. Natasha and Miles, you have both made the declarations required by law and you've made solemn promises and a binding contract to each other in the presence of your friends and family gathered here today. Today is the start of a new life for you together. We hope that the feeling of love that you have for each other will deepen and grow ever stronger throughout the years to come. It gives me great pleasure to declare that you are now husband and wife. <laughs> Throughout the years we've shared with Lunella so far, she's been kind, patient and loving. And I look forward to the many more years we have to share with each other in the future. Ladies and gentlemen, may I ask you to raise your glasses to Natasha, my wonderful wife.